Thanks Mark for your short, the teachers are very nice, helpful and easy to talk to. The teachers are all very helpful and very kind. And everyone is quite friendly. What I like about this school is that um, all the teachers are friendly and approachable. Every teacher knows every student and vice versa. Uh, just a great, great atmosphere. <laughs> <laughs> Clough to is a small school so everyone knows each other and everyone is quite friendly. I like the school because the availability of the teachers and the flexibility in the school. It's just the ability to know each student and for the kids to be able to come to us and say they don't understand something or they're having a hard time or that they're really happy and uh, I think that's really why Clough to has uh, uh, just a great, great atmosphere and a, it's a great place for the kids to come and they'll be so welcome and we will mind them. One of the things I really like is how welcoming the teachers are because going into first year is like really daunting because it's a whole new experience but they help us settle in really quickly and I think everyone will agree that like they're really enjoying all the new subjects and new things that we're doing. Most teachers know you by name and year and some of the optional subjects are woodwork and art, metalwork and home ec, music and music and tech class. Kaloch de Koshore is not just any school. It's a deeply connected community of learners striving together every day for excellence. Hi, I'm a third year student in Colossus Kishore. What I like about this school is that um, all the teachers are friendly and approachable and all the choice subjects are good and my favourite subject would be PE because we do a lot of sports and activities. I like the fact that we have a half day every Wednesday um, and it makes us easy to spend time with your friends and get all your homework done. Uh, my favourite subject is metalwork. I like it because it's very practical. The variety of subjects are very good. A few of my favourite subjects are music, homework and PE. It's also convenient for me as I live in the village and it takes two minutes to get to school every morning. There is also a service to order your lunch from the local centre and get stuff from the duck shop. English and French and LCVP and CSP here in the school. Um, I'm a tutor for one of the year groups and I suppose what I really want to talk about is just what um, a brilliant atmosphere this school has. Uh, it starts off first thing in the morning when, uh, with the tutor group. Ostensibly that's just to take the role where it's really just to check in, see the faces, see everybody is there and you have a chance to ask them how they're doing and they get that time to just 
relax into school life and check out their timetable or whatever else. Uh, I like the school because it's a small school. It, if you fall behind, it's very easy for a teacher to notice and come help you. And also it's a small school because every, it's good that it's a small school because everybody knows each other and it's very easy to make friends. This year we're very excited to introduce Transition Year to Kolosh to Koshura. We have introduced a broad and dynamic programme which we know will provide a wide range of learning opportunities for our students. Our broad choice of subjects and our small class sizes means that we can create a unique learning environment where students can enjoy a very individualised classroom experience. Colossus Koshura is connected to Microsoft Office 365. It's an online platform that allows teachers and students to share and collaborate on documents from any device. Every student has access to Microsoft Word, PowerPoint and Excel. This online tool is currently being used by the majority of colleges in Ireland alongside many major Irish companies. The Alon Imachti Shock Curricular or Shuli Galosh Kashura, Kosula Kyol, Dromiat, Agus Ernoi Sports, Rahampla, Kishfel, Pelhelak, Imoniat, Agus Soccer, and all students are encouraged to take part in extracurricular activities. We have a variety of sports teams such as soccer, hurling, Gaelic football, basketball and more. I enjoy the wide range of sports in the school. There's soccer, Gaelic football, football and hurling leagues in the school and the school is very open to new sports suggestions. And then because the school is a, a real, really like a proper community school, um, we have the chance every day to see the kids and to speak to them. And okay, things are a little different now when parents would have been you know, able to come to the school, we still have um, great communications with everybody. Hi, I'm part of the student support team. I'm what's called the Home School Liaison Officer, or HSCL. I am the link between the community, the family, and the school, the middleman. I I'm on the phone to parents, I do home visits, I bring some parents in for classes. We've done cookery, computers and yoga in the good times before lockdown, but we hope to continue again. So you might be hearing from me. Well, student care and a positive learning environment go hand in hand in Kolosh to Koshura. Every teacher knows every student and vice versa. When you know the individual, you know what motivates them, what their aspirations are. This is how we encourage our learners to flourish. My name is Shane Fox, I'm from Carrigeen and I went to Kolosh to Koshura from the year 2000 until 2005. One of the things I thought was really nice about the school was that some of the teachers I had there also taught my father and that's a nice personal touch that you could only have in a small school like Kolosh to Koshura. And even though it's a smaller school, I was still able to study all the same subjects as my friends who went to De La Salle in Water Park in the Mercy. My favourite subject is probably Irish and Mrs Cummins taught me Irish. She still teaches Irish there. And after going to Clash to Kashur, I went to the University of Limerick and I studied Irish. And I taught Irish for a while in Canada and I taught Irish for a while in the US and in Sweden. And now I'm a translator for the European Union, living in Brussels. Here's my apartment in Brussels. 
So go to Gloucester Gashura, work out your Irish. We need lots of translators over here in Brussels and maybe one day we'll see you over here. Good luck. Hi, my name is Sarah Lynch. Um, I'm a second year student in Trinity College Dublin and I'm studying biological and biomedical sciences. I first did my Leaving Cert back in 2018 and not having fulfilled my ambition, I was coerced, or as my dad likes to say, gently persuaded to go back and repeat my Leaving Cert in 2019. And as a result, I was rewarded with a place in Trinity College. It was a really difficult decision to go back and repeat, but I got enormous support from the teachers in Colosh Koshora. Um, as well as that, using the HERE scheme was very vital in getting my place in TCD. Um, it may sound cringy, but if you work hard, your dreams will come true. Thank you. Hello, my name is Robert Walsh. Uh, it's been a while since I've attended what was then called Munkine Vocational School. I did my Leaving Cert there in 1989. After my leaving cert, I went to Trinity College Dublin where I studied computer engineering. And after graduation, I worked in Dublin for a couple of years with a division of Siemens. After that, I moved to Silicon Valley in California where I've worked with a whole bunch of interesting companies such as Sun Microsystems, Apple, and most recently Facebook, where I help our hardware teams develop a custom silicon for the Oculus headsets. I remember my time at Mooncoin fondly. Uh, given my career, it's probably no surprise to know that I really enjoyed the technical subjects there, um, maths, science, uh, engineering, technical drawing. Um, I was actually quite surprised to find that a lot of the um, engineering and technical drawing materials that we covered were actually part of our first year course in college. Uh, I think Mooncoin really set me up for success in college and for my career afterwards. And I think any student that wants to do well and really applies themselves uh, will be well served at Wilcoid. I wish you all the best and success with your studies. Diva Kaija is Misha Kiwi. I attended the Colossal Shore from 2013 to 2019. Throughout my time in Colossal Shore, I was a part of the Student Council and received an award for Student of the Year. I also received scholarships to, to attend Well Docs. I also received an award from NUIN in my third year for my progression in Irish. From the support and help of the staff at Colossal Shore, I am now studying at my new university in which I am doing a Bachelor of Arts degree. I am doing a double major in Irish and Maths. From this, I will go on to do a teaching Masters. Small limb, but small small. Hello, my name is Owen Welch and I am from Clagham Munkine and I am a former pupil of Gosh Goshura Munkine. I think I was invited on here today because I wrote a history book about the War of Independence, Civil War in Kilkenny, um, a bit of an all good bookshops. Um, I think, when I think back, I can remember my going to my open day in, in the school and I think what it really excited me was the fact that you got to do lots of other subjects. I was very bad at English, Irish and Maths in primary school, so when you went to secondary school to go to one kind to see all these other subjects, whether it be art or geography and history and like metalwork and woodwork and home economics, all those things. Um, kind of allowed you to do something else and find other things you were good at and everything was kind of well equipped and geared for that and I think that's what um, it allows you to do even I can still have I wasn't great at these subjects like metalwork and woodwork but I still have the fire tongs and things I made in, in the first year and it just get kind of broadens your horizons and all those different skills that you learn um, those are things that you kind of remember more or you might use more than the other kind of you know, Matsy and uh, Irish stuff. So it was it was great. And um, I suppose the other thing about it is when you go to a local school, it's community. And the fact that I can go around Munkai nowadays and know people and um, know families that I would have gone to school with. And it's good just to have that kind of integration in your own community that you're not separated from that at a young age. My name is Jonathan Butler, and I'm talking to you from Twin Falls, Idaho, located in the Intermountain West region of the United States, where I currently work as a Director of Finance with Glambia Nutritionals, looking after the finance, accounting and control activities for cheese and whey production across North America. I was a student at Kalosh de Kashura from 2003 through 2008, and I look back very fondly upon my time there. There is a fantastic educational environment at Kalosh and great 
individual emphasis upon each student. The level of one-to-one -one attention in each of the classes on, is unrivaled and prepares all students very well, ultimately for state examinations and for further higher level education or entry to the world of work. In addition, there's great emphasis on extracurricular activities with huge involvement in sporting competitions, in sporting tournaments, as well as involvement in local enterprise authority competitions and young scientist competitions. But beyond all of that, Kalashta Kashura, for me, was a great environment in which to develop as a rounded individual with the necessary social and interpersonal skills that set success for me on my higher education path and ultimately for entry to the world of work. After my time at Kalashta Kashura, I went on to WIT to study a BA Honours in Accounting and ultimately obtained my Masters in Accounting through Chartered Accountants Ireland, initially working in public accounting in Ireland before transitioning to Glanbia and then to the United States. When I think back on the cornerstone of my success, the very foundation, it was firmly rooted in Kalosh to Kashura, in that emphasis and training that I received, not only on education, but on developing the skills that allowed me to be a rounded person and to succeed on a path of further education and qualification. I will always look back very fondly upon my time at Kalosh to Kashura, and I hope that you too will have the opportunity to share in the environment and skill sets that Kalosh to Kashura can provide to you.